See, I've been training all my life to reach my present day fights. I've been working in the dark just to extend the life. I've been over YouTube. Ross here. Just doing a little video for you guys. Today, I wanted to show you my flatbed slash sled deck setup that I built this year for my 06 Duramax. So, I had a great day on the snow bike today, and yeah, let's take a look at this thing. So, this thing started as a 06 Duramax. I'm going to do a video on the whole truck once I get a little bit more done to it. Got a few things coming, like an MBRP exhaust and uh, just a few other things I got in the works. So, uh, the deck though, the flatbed slash deck. So, this started as a great northern flatbed. It's got two toolboxes in front of the wheels. I kind of liked that look. I initially wanted to go with a fully skirted deck, but in order to keep the price down, uh, like on the whole truck build, I just went with this. This was four grand installed. I even got myself some sweet backup lights for that. Uh, it was a, a pretty good, pretty good deal. I'm pretty excited with it and uh, happy with it for the price. So that was the other reason I didn't go with a full custom sled deck flatbed build. I also didn't want, um, don't want to have to run glides all summer. Uh, I want to be able to take my deck off and beat the heck out of it in the summer as a as a true flatbed. So, uh, mounted up the North Cascade deck on it. Really, ex really happy with the North Cascade decks. I've been using them for uh, about man three or four years now. So, really quality deck. As you can see, it's got full uh, diamond plate top, aluminum, uh, so you don't have any wood rot issues. Um, your wood doesn't get beat up or go bad, and you don't have to replace it. So. That's a really cool setup with these decks. And uh, yeah, so basically what I did is I took the the deck and cut the legs off it. And that still gave me room to leave my ramp in there. So this is a 11 foot expandable, not expandable, but plug and play ramp. So that f you pull the first, the top one out and uh, then plug the top into the bottom and then slide the whole thing out. So. The way that this actually kind of mounted up was really slick. It's impossible to pull this thing all the way out um, without actually pulling my little pin here and separating the two. The way it just kind of frictions itself in there. So really, really nice. Uh, I really like that about the deck. And uh, right now I've got it set up. So it will haul two sleds just like this. And you can see on the flatbed it does not stick out that far. So. I was really happy with, with that. I've kind of made it custom fit like that. It will expand further um, for two sleds. I run narrow front ends so it fits really nicely like this. But then also for a standard truck bed, this deck does adjust in and out. You can see right here, uh, it adjusts in and out for uh, to, to fit really nicely a single sled and also look really sharp on your truck when you, you're hauling just one or no sleds at all. So. The way I mounted this was I just bolted a piece of square steel tubing to the stake pockets and then bolted it to the sled deck itself. So that's the only thing holding it on um, is, is a big steel tubing up front. And then it's also rubber matted in between the deck and the flatbed itself. So I don't have any issues of um, vibrations or anything like that. It's not beating up my flatbed it all winter long and this thing is not going anywhere that's for sure the other cool thing that it allows is i've got some cool storage up here for like gas cans or gear um, works really really slick and then i can also instead of having my headache rack right here i can bring my sleds up into um all the way up front and then also i can even have my ski kind of stick out the side a little bit so i don't have sleds hanging all the way off the back the other nice thing about this is it, the sled deck doesn't hang too far off the back of the flatbed, so it looks pretty clean just sitting there, even without a sled on it. Uh, really pumped about that. So, yeah, that's about all I got for you guys. Um, the North Cascade deck is, it's got these adjustable spring pins right here. So if you're going to get one of these decks and you're going to run it um, on a pickup without a flatbed, then you can use these spring 
spring tabs to adjust it in and out makes it really really easy i've got my uh, tabs for my sled locks on there obviously don't have any real legit system for my snow bike but you know it is what it is you can't always be perfect so this was a pretty cool setup i thought for uh for the price it's nothing special looks pretty clean and uh, i'm really excited about it so just uh wanted to show you guys that i've gotten some questions about it like i said and yeah thanks for watching i really appreciate it uh leave your thoughts let me know what you guys think of this and uh i'm gonna come out with a video i think on the whole truck once i get a few things done waiting on some exhaust and uh yeah just kind of get finished up so not a crazy build but simple and clean and easy thanks for watching please subscribe leave your comments let me know what you guys think thank you so much and uh maybe i'll see you on the hill